Hi everyone, in this video we are going to study about regeneration in planaria. Before that we should know about the, what is regeneration. Regeneration is the process of growing of new cells or new body part for one which has been injured or lost. This is the overview of regeneration in planarians and planarians have high power of regeneration. It has two complementary processes. One is epimorphosis, another one is morpholaxis. Epimorphosis means missing parts are formed. Morpholaxis means original parts are fit to function with regenerated parts in new individual like this. This is the original head where the regenerated part is fixed to this and performed as a new individual. This is known as morpholaxis. And if we cut uh, longitudinally to the planarians means uh, here you can see there are two cuts longitudinally. It uh, develops uh, into two heads and it will form monster like structure uh, which is known as heteroma. If you cut planaria into two pieces like this, uh, the two individual gives new individual with regenerated parts and uh, this middle piece grow into also new individual anterior region going to give rise to head and posterior region going to give rise to tail region. This theory was explained by CM Child. CM Child explains through metabolic or axial gradient theory. In this theory he explained that each um, part of the planaria means anterior region and posterior region. Uh, which maintain their original linear polarity. Anterior region have high metabolic activity hence it going to give rise to head and posterior region has low metabolic activity it going to give tail through anterior posterior axis of the body. In another case like regeneration in sexual uh, sexually mature planaria if you cut uh, the planaria across pharynx and copulatory organs what will happen the two halves fail to regenerate sex organs means genitalia degenerates and they form asexually uh, developed new individual the recent studies uh, said that if we cut planaria what will happen what are the cells responsible for the regeneration of planarians here uh, they said that uh, free cells from mesenchyme called neoblast or formative cells migrate towards the cut surface and form blastema blastema which develops into new parts uh, in this process uh, new planarians uh, are formed external shocks like radiations uh, will stop the regeneration like this uh, regeneration processor stopped through radiation um, uh, radio uh, radiations affects neoblast cells which avoids formation of blastema and uh, uh, they avoid regeneration thank you for this thank you for watching